Okay, shalom, shalom, shalom. Como esta capo? Welcome to the Philip, to the Jupino show, the Jewish Filipino show. This is a continuation of the Cave of the Winds show, and uh, just at the bottom of the elevator, we come out to this cave to a staircase that supposedly walks up as close as we can underneath the falls. But uh, I stopped at the top of the elevator so we didn't have to sit and watch us go down a crowded elevator ride. And we get another show was good. First part, part one was getting a bit long. So here we are coming through Cave of the Winds on the American side. And this is on the New York side of Niagara Falls. For those of you who can't make it over the border into Canada, or just don't want to for some reason, we figure we do the American side first. But uh, we're recycling our ponchos from the Maid of the Mist. And we, we've got do not litter, no unattended bags, no climbing on the rocks, no All right, so we can recycle, and we're good. All right. All right. So this is actually where we stopped the hike. And uh, she wanted a new one. Talaga, <laughs> talaga. We're getting on. <laughs> They're getting, They're getting organized again. People are recycling their ponchos so they can do the Maid of the Mist and the Cave of the Winds. You don't have to use two ponchos for both. You can recycle the other one. Just to let you know, on the other side, on the Canada side, they have a, a train, a, what they call a funicular train, that goes down the side of the hill to get to the boat. But uh, we're not on the Canada side today. Today's, we're on the American side. This is something we're doing that uh, a couple other YouTubers haven't done so far, I guess. But uh, I figure I'll take you. I'll just give you my personal opinion. What's going on? This is actually what it looks like. The American side underneath these heavy duty rocks along the trail we were on earlier on the Maid of the Mist boat that came out there we're getting pretty we went on the early boat so we, we went on the morning wind got a pretty dredge now it seems like the winds calmed down a little bit but I'm a slow walker so I hope you don't mind uh, as everybody else runs ahead of me so, but I'm, I'm just trying to walk. I need a gimbal so I don't bounce around all here comes the wind. I catch up on the wind. So, oh, there goes that big tower that we are on. That, uh, came down to go on the Maid of the Mist. As you can see the water spraying over. That's a pretty cool view. I see you and your new friend there. And, these are old wood decks, I guess they made in the 1800s when they became in the carnival days, like we saw in the first video. I got a choice of whether I'm going to go up or down. Picture pictures. More picture pictures. Okay. Where's your video? I'm on video right now. Okay. Say hi, everybody. We're on video. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We're having too much fun. All right. Say hi to everybody back in Manila and Mindanao and Cebu and all the other. <laughs> okay, say goodnight. 
We're going down. We're going down now. Okay, we're going down. <laughs> we're going on an adventure. Okay, slow people on the right, fast people on the left. Okay, I'm turning my hat around. I've got to turn my hat around because the wind's blowing pretty hard and it's a pretty steep staircase. So, uh, this is just an adventure. I don't know. I hope, we're, I hope Mrs. Jupino likes this because I don't think she'd be able to walk down this now. But, uh, just to get a view of what we're doing, we're coming down the steep staircase. Okay, get a walk along the... Sorry, those are fast, fast walking. So we made, we met friends who are my new guests on my Filipino show. I didn't even know who they were. But we met them here at the falls. So other than my Ate Arce, we made some new friends who you can leave a comment on the on the bottom RC, I'll tell you who they are. Here they are as we get a little closer. Closer to the falls. There, I feel the breeze coming this way. Stop and hold anybody else up. I'm going to keep going down. Okay, this, is like a, this is like a carnival ride. That's amazing. Worth like a million, million words. I can't even <laughs> explain how to explain this. This is amazing. You wouldn't believe it. These little falls are coming down. This is it's like totally worth it. I never thought the American side was so exciting. So picturesque. So beautiful. So maganda. Okay, and I'm going to take a walk down these stairs. Hope I don't drop my camera. I got to hold it on pretty tight. So, Uh, the pictures, the pictures can't give any words to the sense that you're feeling of the, the power of the water, the mist, the just the taste of the mist in your mouth from uh, from the from the wind coming up is kind of hard to explain on video, right? But, uh, trying to avoid other people. There's RC. Wave RC. Oh, there he is. Okay. Okay. But just the taste of the water in the mouth is pretty amazing, you know. It's all, uh, tastes very salt watery. Kind of like you've been in the ocean. It doesn't taste like fresh water. People are having a good time. Taste of the water in your mouth is a mist. You're 
Way out. That's the only way out, aren't they? Well, I guess we're going to zoom out a little bit. So we've got to go all the way up these stairs to get out that way. Now they're kind of freaking out. They don't even realize how wet it is. Now that's more scary than anything. I'm not scared of the heights. Just I'm scared that the, they built it actually, that the, the sticks are actually in the water. Right. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I'm kind of trying to stall a little bit just to let everybody else take pictures and come through. But as I said, it's, it's like uh, going to the beach and tasting the salt water. Excuse, excuse me. Look at it, and all the algae growing up on the sticks. And you know those sticks are holding together pretty, pretty amazing for a while. And uh, wow. I think RC's somewhere up there. Yep, RC's up there in the, one of the pink ponchos behind all the sea of yellow ponchos. Look at the water. Look at the algae just growing on the growing on the wood. It's just splashing over. Okay. Hang on, RC's yelling at me. Come up. Okay. It's too close. Getting too. Okay. okay, it's getting too slippery. Okay, so I don't know if we can go back out that way. I don't know. I thought that's the only way out. To the right. You don't have to go close to the water, but it cuts off to the right. Okay. He said, oh, see, that's what they're worried about. It's very slippery. Hear the thundering of the water. Right, and my my feet are getting soaked. Yeah, that's why the water's just splashing under the stairs, getting everybody's feet. Careful. 
off. People are just stopping at the stop of the stairs. Hello, excuse me. You're at the, you're blocking the stairs. Thank you. Our turn. Oh, as the wind's blowing, we're getting all wet. Trying to take my time so I don't slip and fall. Tripping on my poncho. Now it's getting pretty scary. There's all the algae, all the algae on the ground. Now I know why they close it up at certain times of the year. But I don't think, uh, I'm glad I could take this video for everybody else, for a lot of people who are handicapped, can't make it. There goes RC. RC didn't want to go up to the top level. But I think I'm going to kind of give it a try. And all the gloves are soaking wet. Poor girl. Oh These kids are sliding around. So we're trying to make it up. What's called the hurricane deck. Today's the last day of the season that the hurricane deck is going to be open. I don't want to try. Do it. I want to be the adventurous one. The Darcy's and her friends. The peanut crew. This is like they're going to be able to do it. But I'm out of breath. And I just felt kind of super cold. Take my time.
Okay, everybody. I did it. I did it. I got shocking.